Hi guys, we are going to design this wonderful campaign flyer using PowerPoint. So stay tuned. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, kindly hit on the subscribe button to subscribe. It's free. If you are not new here, thank you for coming back. I really appreciate you guys. So to get started, we'll open our PowerPoint software, Microsoft PowerPoint. I'm using the 2013 version. You can use any other version you want. The features are there. Those we are going to use here, they are very basic and they are there. So you open, you open a blank presentation. Then you go to design and move here, change the slide size to custom and here you enter the values you want to enter so i'll move this custom then the values 25 by 25 you can use any other squared size you want depend on your choice if you want to print it bigger use a bigger size because this is just not bigger than not that bigger than a4 sheet it's a bit bigger than the a4 sheet so when you do that you select everything and you clear the screen and first of all these are the resources i'll be using the picture and the school logo so i'll drag in the picture So when you drag in the picture, you expand it but not that big. I think this is okay. And I'll go and bring go to insert shapes rectangle. And I'll draw my rectangle right down here. And I'll change the fill. Wait, I'll, I want to use blue. But that blue I want to use is not there. So I'll come here. More colors. Then I'll go to custom. And here. The blue is there. So to just get blue, when you go to the custom, you can just turn off the red to zero and also change the green to also zero, leaving the blue. That's an RGB. So when you do that, you have your blue color there. Sorry, it's not applying. Sorry, that was text field I used. So when you come here, shape field, you insert your blue. And you have that you go to insert again right angle right angle triangle so you go to the basic shapes and it's right down there you pick it you come and draw it you draw it in your design Adjust it a little bit. Okay, and I'll change down the fill. I'll use the same way, more colors, and at a custom, I'll make the green two five five, red zero, blue zero, to give me the green I want. This pure green. And I'll now add insert an eclipse. So when you look in the basic shapes, you find it right there. It's called over. But I want to draw it in a form of a circle. So what I'll do is I'll hit on the shift key 
then draw it that will give me a circle if I hadn't done that and I was to just draw it the shape wouldn't be that regular so I just simply do it with the shift key press down you yeah, adjust the size I think this is good shape filled to change the fill to white and the outline fill you change it to green the green we use for the triangle background and you come and change the weight change it to four and half pixels point this place uses points instead of pixels so when you do that you now come i'll type in the name so what i can simply do is just hit on the keys and start typing in the shape and i'll change the text color to blue asian dark so the name is atenga joel you go to home and on the font i'll use impact and i now increase the font size so i'll use 35 this is okay and so after that is done you now come and insert text we will insert the text for the position and others so I have here as and the font will be using there is the font style is called style You have to select the text before you type, you search for the font star. So it is right here. I change the font color to white. And then insert another one. Text. And that will be fast level 200 rep. I want the font style to the area. So I'll reduce the font size. is okay and what you can just do is copy the ass one and paste it and use it down here for you change the text to four and at the same place we we'll now also copy the first rep copy so copying you just control plus C and to copy control plus V to paste so 20 20 20 21 and that is it reduce the size and we'll change the font color to to white So we'll come and add his motor down here so go to shapes insert a rectangle shape fill we'll fill it with white then we'll type in let's make a difference The text for this file, so we'll just change it to red and 
change the font style also to area increase it a little bit and readjust it down here then what's now left it is the name of the school and the faculty that's the first so go to insert test at then drag it to the top reduce the font size we change it to six, 16 now type faculty of applied Life Sciences, UDS, and Jungo Campus. So let's just increase the font size not 18. Then we don't want the text shadow to be there, so just click here to remove it. And bolden it a little bit. And place it in the middle. By so we will now insert in the logo. So I'll go to where my results are. So the logo is here. You pick it, drag and drop inside your design. And I readjust it. So The size is now okay. You copy it, Control plus C, then Control plus V to paste, and drag it to the other side. It's now left with the root. So insert word at at this place. So root. The font size I'll use here is called Chili One. I change the text field to red, and we are done with the design. So now let me readjust the picture to the middle. So what you can now do is to save it. So when you want to save it in an editable form, you save it still as a what? Presentation. PowerPoint presentation. That's dot pptx. So the name I'll name it Joel. Then to save it as a picture, you go the same way. So file instead of save now, we'll now you save as. Then when you go to the folder, you click down here, save as type, and you scroll to JPEG. So you can also use the P engine which is down here, but advisable use JPEG since that is the best format for pictures with background. And you can also save it as PDF or any other format you want. But here I'll be saving it as picture, uh, a picture that's the JPEG file format. So when I hit, you click on the save. It will give you two options: save or export all slides to picture or just this one. Since we did only one page, uh, one slide, we'll just use this one, just this one. And after you are done, you go to your folder and it's there. So this is the one I did previously, I named that Tinga Joel, and this is the current one, Joel 2. So that's it for this video. If you liked it, hit on the subscribe button, and I'll get back to you later. Thank you.